The date is December 31st, 2017. The place is Punta Airport in Costa Rica. Nature Air Flight 9916 was preparing for a flight to San Jose, the capital of Costa Rica. The aircraft had been in service for 16 years and had a total of 12,000 flight hours. It was generally used for short distances. The captain pilot of the flight, Juan Manuel Ratana, was the cousin of Laura Chinchilla, former president of Costa Rica. The captain pilot had a total of 15,000 flight hours. The co-pilot was 26 years old. He had 453 flight hours in his career. There were two pilots and 10 passengers on board. The passengers on board were all tourists traveling for sightseeing. This small group consisted of two American families and a guide accompanying them. Flight 9916 was the second flight of the day and was to carry passengers checking out of the hotel to Juan Santa Marina Airport in San Jose. Both airplanes were Cessna 208 Caravan model. The local time was 11.50. The pilots completed their checklists and started the engines. The first plane took off using runway 03. After takeoff, they made a right turn through a pass in the hills to reach the Pacific. The first plane to take off successfully landed in San Jose. The plane that did not take off had suffered a bird strike on the previous flight. The pilot stayed on the ground for 15 minutes longer to assess the extent of the damage. Due to this bird strike, the aircraft's performance was less than normal. For this reason, the pilot said they would change the route to an area where they could fly at a lower altitude. The second plane also started its engine on the runway. It was 12.05 local time. The pilots chose to take off from the runway overlooking the mountainous terrain, rather than the runway facing the sea from which the other plane had taken off. The pilots lined up on the runway and gave full power to their engines. They took off at exactly 12.10. After takeoff, the captain continued in the direction of the runway without turning the airplane in any direction. There were hills left and right in the direction of the runway, and the height of these hills was gradually increasing. As the plane continued to move forward, the pilots realized that the plane did not have enough power to climb. In order to avoid hitting the hills, they tried to make a left turn towards the terrain. During this steep turn, the flight crew could not maintain sufficient airspeed and reached a maximum bank angle of 75 degrees. As a result, the airplane lost its ability to stay aloft and began to fall rapidly towards the terrain. The left wing struck tree branches, cut through them and crashed steeply to the ground. There were no survivors on board. The last images of this airplane are now coming up on the screen. Thank you for watching me.